Okay, silence in the workroom. All right. What's my question? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> The reason I came to the Bishop Stockwood High School is because I really enjoyed my last five years at the school and I know that the quality of teaching is great. It's a great selection of extracurricular clubs, so it's something that everyone wants to do. I came from a really small school and so I was a bit nervous about going to a big school and I thought the school was really friendly and had a lot of options for subjects and enrichment and stuff. I thought that it would offer me a much better all-round education with all the different options that they do as well as your subjects. I chose a sick form because I knew it would offer me a lot of further opportunities down the line for uni and stuff. I picked TVSHS sick form because it's looked very well for me. Um, and I chose it because it had a great range of opportunities outside of lessons. I picked TVSHS sick form because they offer really good subjects that help me when I go to uni. I think the best thing about sixth form for me is doing free A levels that I really enjoy and that particularly being drama. Uh, I think the best thing about the sixth form for me uh, I'd say is probably the quality of teaching, just the way the teachers uh, will spend loads of extra time doing things like clinics uh, really helps out with your learning. The best thing about the Bishop Stalkwood High School is the community, okay, it may sound slightly cringe but in fact, I think you know all the students from across the year groups actually do genuinely work together and like each other. It's forced me to meet a lot more people that I wouldn't have met before, and I think it's really good. Uh, I think the best thing about this sixth form was the way that the new sixth formers were like introduced to the school. They did lots of like mini meetings and things to make sure that we were all comfortable. Uh, I think the best thing about this sixth form is the enrichment opportunity and like having an hour to do something for yourself. Probably agree with that. The best thing about TVSHS six form is the amount of independent study they give us, um, and they also give us a lot of privileges where we can leave early, which really makes us independent. Uh, the best thing about the TVSHS six form is how far the teachers are willing to help you. Know. Yeah. <laughs> that is very welcoming, and um, you get to meet loads of new people. Um, the best thing about TVSHS sixth form is the wide range of extracurricular activities. Probably coming from an all girls school into a mixed school, I thought it was a bit weird. Um, took some time to get used to it, but it's fine once you settle in and it's easy to settle in at this school. The hardest part for me coming to the sixth form was leaving all my old friends from my old school behind. But it was actually much easier than I thought it would be as everyone's really welcoming and kind and it didn't feel like I was in a scary place. Um, definitely the biggest challenge coming to the school was the um, COVID restrictions and getting to grips with that. Um, I think the biggest challenge was obviously the workload of GCSE to A-levels. <laughs> the most challenging thing about coming to TVSHS 6 form was trying to learn the lines for Jerusalem. A-level chemistry. Yes, yeah, so I'd have to agree, really stay on top of all the, all the work, but extra work that you're given. Uh, trying to make my way through the corridor, really. Um, the most challenging thing about the most TVSHS sit form is probably finding your way round and just trying to know where you're meant to be at that time. What's enhancement? So enhancements are basically another thing you can do on top of your A-levels. Uh, some of them are a good sort of complement to the A-levels that you're currently studying and it basically gives you something else to do. So the enhancement that I have taken is EPQ, which is a fantastic opportunity to actually get to research something that you enjoy. Because obviously if you're planning to go to university, which some of you might be doing, then that's a great skill to prepare you for that. Uh, enhancements, uh, I do fundamentals of finance, because uh, for me, uh, I enjoy doing maths. Uh, and I think if doing chemistry, maths and biology all fails, uh, I've then got somewhat of a backup in the form of finance. I do gold DOE. I, I quite like this as there's only one lesson of it per week, so I get quite a lot of free periods, which is very helpful. But um, I have a really good group of friends from there now that I wouldn't have met otherwise. I take a core math enhancement, which might be a bit of a pain because there's lots of lessons per week. But I feel like, I feel like it complements my computer science and chemistry A level, which is what enhancement should do. Um, I just did sports leadership, um, which was good because I, mean, I got to do some volunteering. 
I think I'm the only person in the year that does it, but uh, I messaged Mr. Munro about it and he allowed me to go play golf, so I go play golf every week. I took the um, scary option of dodgeball. I'm not very good at it, but uh, it's really fun and you get to meet loads of new people that way and it's a good laugh. I either go running with uh, the head of sick form and show them up, which is quite nice. Um, I alternate netball and debating and I really like both of them. I do interact, so I help with all the charity basis of the school and it's good fun. Uh, I do debating and mock bar. Um, I knew I was going to like debating but um, I was quite surprised by how interesting mock bar was. Um, in Richmond I do rugby up the top, uh, which is really fun, good fitness, really good uh, meeting other people who enjoy the same thing, it's a really good experience. Um, I also do board games because I love Monopoly. Uh, for enrichment, I do debate and mock bar trial, which I enjoy quite a bit, and you get to compete in competitions with them. Uh, and for enrichment, I go off-site to a gym. I go to an external gym, and I do art. For enrichment, I do rugby. For enrichment, I do dodgeball. Um, for enrichment, I do board games. Do not buy skirts if they are above your knee. Only do a subject if you genuinely want to do it. Now, when I joined Sixth Form, I did think that maybe like the year 12s were being a bit over the top on how much work you get, but it turns out they weren't, and you actually do get quite a bit more work than I was expecting, but just be prepared for that, because there's a lot. Just have fun. I'd say choose it on like what subjects there are and what opportunities you can get. Yeah, I definitely agree. Don't go with what your friends are doing because you'll make lots of friends when you go to it. So, yeah. So one piece of advice I'll give to Year 11 is just trust your gut. If you can make some leave, you don't like it. Uh, one piece of advice I'd give to any Year 11 is to seriously consider sort of every possible thing that could affect your sixth form life. Once you find your sixth form, just start working as soon as possible because you'll get behind very quickly. Um, one piece of advice I can give is once you know where you're going, make sure you're organised and you know what topics are going to come up and stuff like that. Um, probably make sure that you just try and stay on top of your work because there is a lot of it. <laughs> Oh, I, I thought you had to keep it running like the whole time, so it's going to be a pain to edit. Yeah. I feel so sorry for the person who edits. 